Yo, yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to EMC, man. I'm here with the new project car. This is the Toyota GR Yaris, okay? I've been looking forward to this for a while. If you guys follow me on IG, you guys know I've been talking about this for a little bit. I haven't driven a manual car in a while, okay? Um, I used to have all manual cars, but you know, now it's finally going back to my roots and I fucking love it, right? Um, but yeah, the GR Yaris, this is a 1.6 liter, three cylinder, turbocharged, little like monster. Look at this thing. We're probably gonna do this car a little bit differently because it is a JDM and we haven't done a JDM car in a while now. There are a lot more parts that will go into this car. So I think we're gonna slowly kind of like document it. When you look at this car, uh, there are things that jump off the page immediately, right? First of all, it's a three door, you know what I'm saying? Instead of like a five door, it's just really cute, but it it's all, also looks kind of badass, right? We're really, really looking forward to showing you what we're gonna do with this car. It's gonna be a process, but I'm sure uh, people are gonna love it and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it, all right? All right, so, uh, you know, enough talking. Uh, I don't wanna talk too much outside of this car because I just wanna get into it and drive it all the time. Without further ado, let's get in and uh, go for a drive. Here in the Yaris. If you go online, you know, watch some other YouTube reviews about this, you know, even Chris Harris, right? Uh, one thing they keep on saying about the GR Yaris is this is the homologation car. Homologation, homologation. Homologation, homologation. So what does that mean? That's basically just a fancy word to say that it's basically race approved. So in this case, this car is race approved for the WRC, you know, World Rally, Bali side, right? Yo, rest in peace, Ken Block, okay? I gotta plug that in. You know, it's a homologation car, other notable homologation cars, you know, you have Mitsubishi Evo, right? You have the Peugeot 205, you have the Audi Quattro, you know, these cars are all legends, literally legends, right? So I've had this car for about a week uh, already. I haven't started modding it. Uh, we're actually on our way to go mod it right now. I've wanted to get like a small car for this city. I do live in Taipei and it does get a little bit crowded. I thought about getting a GTI or like a Mini Cooper, but when I saw the Yaris, I knew I really wanted it. You know, this car is, you know, close to 300 horsepower for such a small platform. It means it moves, man. And it's a four wheel drive and the there's a handbrake, right? And you know, if you've seen our vlogs, you know, me and Sonny are big on handbrakes now because not a lot of cars have them now. So yeah, we're on our way uh, actually to get the suspension system done. Shout out to KW, thank you guys. We're gonna head over right now and um, get this set up. We'll see you in a little bit. Okay, so we CWC, Kaiwei you know, we know, we gotta lower this guy, okay? Because it does ride a little bit high. Come over, let me show you the suspensions. Like I said, thank you, KW. Look at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful set. Pretty iconic with the KW colors, right? So yeah, this is a high-low adjustable. Uh, coilovers, right? Yeah. I'm always happy when I get parts. Yeah, I can't wait. Um, you know what, I gotta, I gotta show you this. Somebody here has really, really good taste because look at what we ran into right here. Look at this X6 with our EMC wheels, bam. Yeah, man, those are the bougies, all right? Those are the bougies. So uh, if you guys have a Beamer, you guys know, you guys gotta get the bougies, all right? So yeah, this guy's got a really good taste. All right, so they're gonna start working on this car soon and uh, we'll be back in a couple hours to pick it up. Yeah, all right, man, let's go. Hey guys, okay, so we're back at CWC. Kaiwei Chi no, what a suspension guy how. Go and see. So you can see that it's already from the 4 of 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 the 
我觉得这是一个蛮基本的一个一个一个一个一个 setting. Now, if you look at it, it looks much lower, a little bit more aggressive. Uh, obviously, we have EMC wheels coming in, uh, but they're not here yet. So uh, you know, this is just stage one. I don't even want to call it that. Actually, this is just like the very first thing you do to a car is lower, right? Bai Gai Jiang Wei Xian. We have just a bunch of stuff coming in. You know, I literally went to. Uh, I'm not going to disclose what brand, but uh, I asked them like what they had for the GR Yaris, and I told them to give me like one of everything. <laughs> so uh, that's kind of cool, you know. Uh, Japanese parts, JDM parts, you know, are much more affordable than uh, you know uh, European and Italian, German cars, right? So um, I'm having a blast, just like picking up parts and uh, you know ordering stuff and fixing it up, right? 改车这种东西就是它是一个一个乐趣，你懂吗？你要享受它的过程，要研究它。然后去订这些 parts， 然后等这些 parts， 然后装这些 parts， 然后去感受 how much it improves the car， right？ So all these little things are why you know how can you not be romantic about fixing up cars？ You know， you got to be romantic about this， right？ Okay， so yeah， let's go take a look at the interior because、uh, we did a couple GoPro shots， but we didn't get、uh, like a you know full view of it. So as you can tell， the first thing that stands up is you know the GR badge。They have it on the calipers and the side and in the back。And、uh, the carbon roof. They had to lower this roof so that、uh, you know the center of gravity wasn't so high, right? So come check it out. The best things about this car immediately that I felt was the pedal position. So as you can see, it's like you can like just reach over with the side of your foot and kind of kind of blip it, right? And the the gear feels very mechanical. I haven't misshifted once yet since I had this car. It's just it's. Very precise, you know. Unlike the regular Yaris, it does have a you know GR start stop button right here, which is which is pretty cool. And then、uh, it has the sport and track mode. So when you go into track,、uh, your、uh, display turns red right here. And then it does have a head-up display,、uh, HUD, just like you know you're, what you're used to in like Beamers and stuff. Yeah, and it has a really cool WRC badge here. It's quite cool. And if, but if you look at the seats, look at how thick this shit is, right? Look at how thick this, these chairs are. These chairs gotta go. These chairs. Absolutely, gotta go. So、uh, that's that, that's coming very soon, and、uh, everybody just stay tuned. We're gonna do a bunch of stuff in this car. I think、uh, overall, this car is just a very very fun toy to have. You know, I mean, if you can have a small car that you want to drive around the city that has good parking, and、uh, you know that you can get around the alleys. You know, I, I would be hard pressed to find a better, you know, 更好的选择了 You know,、uh, this episode, you know, this vlog is、uh, about to end, but. This is just the very, very beginning of this long journey of fixing this car up. So you know, stay tuned, follow us, and、uh, you know, give us some comments below. You know, hit the like button.、Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe. And、uh, you know, GR Yaris project, yo, let's go, EMC.